Hello again, this is Caleb Crisp, and sorry for this weird position I'm in right now. I've got this uh, nice Blue Yeti microphone that uh, is a million times better than the DSLR mic, and I really want to use it, uh, but it's kind of, you know, kind of have to lean over to talk to it because it's awkward to hold. So anyway, let's get into the video. So I recently moved out, and I've always wanted to build my own uh, computer desk setup, and not just the computer itself, because I already did that, but uh, my, own, my own desk that has like cables wired through it and has like all these really cool ideas that I want to that I've put down on paper that I can't wait to show you guys. So in future videos you'll be seeing a bunch of um, you know do-it-yourself furniture builds, you know computer desks number one, um, this uh, art desk modification that I'll be doing in a bit, uh, bookshelf builds, you know TV stand or TV like system holders. Uh, so a lot of stuff like that coming in the future. But what this video is is this is just a demonstration about how I took my really nice computer components and peripherals and turned them into a decent setup using only like a you know a cheap fold out Walmart desk that I just found on the back of the porch one day. And uh, honestly, it's still my setup that I'm using now until I uh, until we do the desk build video. So let's go ahead and jump right in, and I uh, hope you guys enjoy. So here is my new room, and I'm uh, quite excited. Sorry it's dark outside, I know that kind of messes with the lighting, it would look better if I had done it in the daytime. But uh, it's a pretty spacious room, I don't really like the location of the window, it looks kind of ominous. But uh, as you can see I'm getting this uh, desk started right up. And honestly you can make up for a bad desk, at least temporarily, with, uh, with nice peripherals and accessories for your computer, and a nice computer itself, I mean let's face it, would you rather get an extra 30 frames in a game, or would you rather have a shiny desk? It's really up to you. I chose the extra FPS. That's a, so let me just lay that down, that's a really nice, like, super long uh, Corsair mouse pad. I forget exactly what it's called, but I'll, I'll throw a link to it in the uh, in the description. That right there I'm plugging in now is the, uh, the Razer, is it Black Widow X Chrome? I think so? Yeah, Black Widow X Chrome, that sounds like it. Very nice, It's uh, it's got a metal frame, and that's what I really like about it. Got it for a very good price. Still new, of course. Also got the Razer Mamba going in over there. It's currently plugged in wired, but there's a little wireless adapter. And I've got uh, reviews on both of these, though I'm uh, not very pleased with the quality. I had to film them with an iPhone. <laughs> Alright, now we're just digging through crap, wondering what to do next. It's me aimlessly walking around, and for some reason, I noticed this while I was editing it, I continuously pick up that sword and just carry it around. I don't know if I'm like afraid to get attacked by something or what. Uh, you also see that I'm wiring up a MacBook Pro and setting the iPad down beside me there. But the MacBook Pro over there is for two different things. One, I use it to uh, edit sometimes, and I also have it giving my computer internet because my like wireless card is messed up or something like that. So I just have the uh, and the the router is all the way downstairs. So I just have an Ethernet cable connecting from my MacBook Pro to my desktop PC, and the MacBook Pro is sharing Wi-Fi. I'm not getting as fast internet as I could be getting, but uh, it's still pretty nice. I, I get about uh, 256 down, I believe, and 256 up. So that's pretty much it for the setting up part, and as you can see, the results are quite nice, honestly. Like, uh, not obviously that mouse cable right there does not have to be there. It's uh, It has its own little adapter that's pretty nice makes it wireless. And here's the, uh, the highest quality b-roll you'll ever see in your entire life. There we go. I, I ended up realizing that it was dark when I was videotaping and deciding on uh, recording it the next morning as well. But as you can see, for a, for a $40 desk, you know, you just wipe it off, put your, uh, put your materials on it, and uh, actually it actually looks pretty nice, I would say. So definitely a I'd say when it comes to just temporary desks that you need to be taken apart and put together real quick, it's, uh, it's not bad at all. And, ooh, that beautiful monitor right there. And I don't know if you can tell in the video, but my wallpaper actually was, like, moving. It's like a, like a motion wallpaper, like video wallpapers. And that's an app that you can download off Steam. I believe it's called Wallpaper Engine. Highly recommend it. I'll throw a link to that in the description as well. But, uh, maybe yeah, we just got a few more shots of the desk here. And that's uh, pretty much the gist of it. I'd say that looks pretty solid for, you know, a desk I found on a porch. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a comment, and like the video if you liked it. Thanks for watching. Toodaloo.